there's something called affirmation. There's something called speaking back the words that God speaks to you. When you speak them, you begin to rise from the inside. God was speaking to Joshua and he said, don't let these words depart from your mouth. That means every time keep saying them. Say them about yourself. Say them about yourself. Keep saying them, saying them, believing them. Papa says, if you don't believe, even a crane cannot lift you. So Papa will come out here and he will tell you of when he was in his one-room boys' quarter. And some of you think, ah, pastors, then there's a big get story. He was in a one-room boys' quarter. His fan, fan, his fan could not, what is that grammar? Oscillate. We, we, it's his tie. This necktie. In fact, oscillate is too far. The, the head of the fan could not stay on the body. So he had to tie it, use tie, to hold the head of the fan to the body. Now there I meet him. No, so that I'm saying this so that when, 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 when he's when you're hearing, say this, believe this. It's not somebody who is coming from ease or coming from a place where it was already made and he's just giving you theory. It is what works. It works. And you have a father and a mother who wants to see you as the best. If not, why the preaching? We we'll just gather you people, you people give offering, and then we chop it. But that's not us. We want you to be better. We want you to look back. After five years, you say, ah, thank God I came to this gateway. And then we too, when we go to heaven, and God is telling us, well done, welcome. You see this person, see that person, see that person. You made their lives what I wanted it to be. Ah, that is the joy. May none of us fail in Jesus' name. Amen. Can I hear you say, I believe? I believe.